going on everybody today i'm going to do dt is the ticker symbol d t e a and this is uh david's t it's headquarters in canada montreal quebec and uh this company is expected to have some revenue boost in the first quarter here in 2019 uh stores have been doubled so the stock uh is i think it's found the bottom now and that's when i'd like to get on it uh just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel hit the bell and uh like the video Let's get right into DT. So if you know David T, you know about this. David T has been steeped in rumors of possible cannabis infused beverages. And if you remember when this news was out, the stock was running really good. But then the company came out and said that they were unaware of any of this stuff going on. The company is basically saying they didn't put this news out there. I think people were just thinking that it's a tea company and that, hey, you know, marijuana is going to be legal in Canada. So, so they're probably going to end up getting an infused tea drink. But once the real news came out, the stock pretty much just started bleeding off and to where it is right now. If the company signs a deal with one of the marijuana producers, the valuation of the company should multiply. So this still is on the table. It's not, it's not completely off the table. And if they do sign with a marijuana company, this stock is going to soar. It's going to multiply. I think it's going to even more than multiply, but there's no news on it yet. Uh, they haven't made any deals, but this could be in the near future. Just have to keep an eye on it. So right here, their target price is 348, which I like that a lot. And then the shares are float are really low, just about 14 million here. So this stock could have a serious pop to it. All right, here's uh, David T's website. You can see all these different kinds of teas they got going on here. Very interesting teas. And you just go down and there's tons and tons of teas. Pretty much everything's under 10 bucks from what it looks like. This stock, uh, since the IPO date in 2015, has had zero reverse splits, so that's good. Um, it's getting close to getting under a dollar, though, which I don't think it will. So speaking of their IPO date, here they are in 2015, uh, ringing the bell at the NASDAQ. And uh, their stock started out at $30, had really high expectations for it. So this kind of reminds me of like a movie or a TV show. So the co-founder of David T. Herschel Siegel, he led a shareholders revolt uh, to replace some board members in the company. And he, they also replaced his CEO. So they had some drama going on in this company. Hopefully all that got fixed. So you got the chart pulled up right here and you can see the peaks right here. This is when all of the marijuana news came out for the infusion drinks. And uh, after that, it's just bleeding off. And, and from what it looks like, it has hit the bottom here. It's what I like. It just got over the trend line here. The low is at 107. And so that's what I think the bottom is right here. And then it's just slowly starting to go up. Let's see, let's go over to the 10 day, 30 minute chart here. RSI is right in the middle. I like where that's at. Everything about this setup, I really like it a lot. It's ready for a big pop to happen. So the stock's at a great position right now. I like where it's at. It's ready for a good pop. It's starting to become bullish. I like it a lot. Just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell and like this video. And let's make some money on this. I'm out.